Hello, everybody. Um, as you saw, we are at uh, Panera's. Um, first time, well, I've been here before, but I usually just get uh, the $3 uh, lemonades and drink like two gallons while I'm here, but I use the internet all the time. But this is our first time um, eating here. Uh, Tasha's first time and my first time. And what did you What did you order? I think I ordered the steak, arugula, and white cheddar. Lift it up. And Pull that, that bread. Uh, oh. See what you got in there. Steak, arugula. Yeah, white cheddar. And white cheddar. And a bowl of turkey chili. Turkey chili. And what is this that we got here? I don't know. Oh, he just picked it for us. It's like chicken something. Maybe I should Maybe ask. It's chicken Tuscany or something. I'll look at my receipt and show you in a second. And they got a hard piece of bread here. Yeah, me and, too. And uh, mac and cheese. He he um, recommended the mac and cheese. I've never um, I've never eaten here, but this came to twenty seven dollars, and the price point to me and being cheap is pretty high. It's and, high to me. Yeah, it's high to her, I'm so it cheap. must be really high. Uh, the French baguette was the hard deals. White cheddar Panera. Steak. That's, mine. That's yours. Oh. You got the chipotle. 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 It's chipotle, I think. Uh, chipotle. But to uh, make people mad, I'm going to say chipotle. So, chipotle chicken. Avocado? Or there's no avocado. One. Yes, it is. Yes. Like two two pieces of avocado. I'm not lying, folks. These are about two chunks of avocados. So, they called it avocado. So, Hopefully they're not watching this review and kick us out because twenty-seven dollars. Eh, eh, eh. no. So who ate, who likes Panera and who is rich enough to, to eat here on a regular basis? Coffee shop, yes, coffee or I like the coffee because they have honey and all kind of stuff up there. Uh, but the, the drinks for three dollars, drinking two gallons is for three dollars. This is the blood orange. I actually like the lemonade, and I get lemonade up to here. Then I get blood orange, so I get like five six of lemonade, and then I get the rest blood orange. But this is all blood orange, so she can try it. That's why I don't get too much of that because it's a little stronger. But I like the lemonade. Paul used to like it. Yeah, it's a ripoff, Mike. Hey, Mike, that is Mike right here, um, Tasha, that we was discussing computers with. Uh, we did oh. a pizza challenge at the cafe. I forgot the name of it. Pizza Cafe in Utah. That's where you can have as many wives as you want, I think. Is that right, Mike? How many wives do you have, Mike? No, he doesn't. <laughs> He's a bodybuilder, too. So I told him my muscles are on the inside. Mine, too. Oh, yes. Uh, I'm going to be getting a new computer soon, but I'm getting help with that, with uh, trying to do some uh, a spin wheel that I asked everybody for their, their opinion, um, what I should put on the spin wheel for, like, if you do a $20 uh, super chat. But on one of those spin wheels, though, I'm going to put a free T-shirt so you can win a free T-shirt. So it's not just, hey, I need some money here and there. I'm going to try to do some prizes and stuff for you guys, too. Yeah, I agree with all y'all saying Panera ripoff because I almost told them I changed my mind. Yeah, because I was with her. She's like, that. he's about to blow his stack. No. <laughs> Nothing to do with you because I would have told him no. But it's. She, it tastes pretty good. Twenty-seven dollars cheese, no. Twenty-seven dollars, yeah. Not for no well, craft mac and shells and cheese, no. Nah. Some hard bread. You can dunk it in my. That's in not my, my heart pounding for Tasha. That is not my heart pounding for Tasha. You folks. can dunk it in my chili if you want. The chili is good though. This is PG. Hmm. This is PG, folks. She wants me to dump this in her chili. Can't you. Sorry, folks. Not sorry, really. Hopefully, there's no car accidents today. We're inside. We're trying to avoid all car accidents today. If you saw last night's video, uh, somebody got smacked by another car, T-Bone, and they left. They might have had a warrant. I'm just speculating. They might have had a warrant or 
uh, they didn't have any insurance or both. I'm going to say both. And um, they left. Hopefully they didn't make it too far down the road and their radiator blew on them or something. I don't know. But uh, cops didn't make it there the whole time we was like, when we left, the cops just showed up or no? They didn't even show up. They was like, you know what? Eh. They said, your hair is pure style. Thanks. They're adding a dinner menu. I will not be going to that dinner menu because dinner sounds more expensive than lunch. This will probably be my first and last time. Yes, I will. Here. Yes, this is too expensive. So they're probably It'd be different if it was expensive and it was like amazing. You try some of this? Um, right. No. Um, I went up there and I, I just wanted her to try a lot of different stuff because I don't care. So then the guy was looking at me like, that's pretty cool with that guy to do that. And I was like, well, they called me the garbage disposal. Bam, gave him a card. So hopefully he's not back there watching now. Uh, but he was a great at the counter of uh, telling us all this is made fresh. Yeah, good uh, customer service. Good customer service. And the gentleman came for the waiter. Great customer service. Asked us to refill the drinks and everything. So no problem with the customer service at all. Just uh, they don't make the prices. So I'm going to try this sandwich here. This huge sandwich. Take a little bite so it lasts longer. I don't eat Arby's. Arby's. Somebody said Arby's Zero is the best. I did an Arby's slider thing. I think I ate in my backyard with the bees flying around me. I did a challenge with bees flying around me. That should be a challenge within itself. Hey, Nicola Johnson. Jacobs. Jacobs. Oh, I'm sorry. I yeah, called you Jacob Johnson. And then I called you. Uh, I thought you was a guy when you first started off in this chat. I am getting it all wrong. But thank you, Miss uh, Jacobs. And I want to say that's kind of why I started the midday because Miss Jacobs couldn't make the. But, you know, she stayed up late anyway, like three in the morning or something mm -hmm. uh, to watch the, uh, the live. So I want to do it for overseas folks. So thank Miss Jacobs for that overseas folks. Mike said he never seen you eat this slow. I'm trying my best. You know what's harder than eating fast? Eating slow. Hey, Katie, thanks for uh, showing up. The pickled onions on here are good. I think. That's Thank you very much, here. Katie. I think uh, Miss Hobbs is at Walmart. The pickles. Pickled onions. Oh, pickled onions. Is that what they do? I think so. Pickled onions are delicious. The red pickled onions at that. That's fan that's fancy. Wendy's is coming out with the breakfast again soon. Was that what I read? Oh. Wendy's. Come out with the breakfast menu. I don't know. I don't know. But this is going to be as exclusive, guys. Uh, you will probably never see me eat at a Panera's again because I cannot afford it. I'm just trying to look like a big shot in front of sexy women. And just like that guy, that, that what you looking for, sexy women? Yeah. But um, just like that guy on the lawnmower smile like this. You ever see a lawnmower commercial? He's like this. He goes, why are you smiling? Because I'm in debt up to my eyeballs. No. <laughs> No. Yes, it is expensive, folks. Yeah, I mean, it tastes good, but if I had like four times the portions, wouldn't you say? What? Like three times at least. If it had three times the portions, four times, it might be worth 27 So I'm thinking this meal, I $16 maybe at the most. Yeah. So two times the portions, I guess. You try that? Somebody said if you go on Panera and don't order a thing, they will feed you for free. Yeah, they got free samples up there. I tried those. What were those? Cookies or something? Yeah, cookies. I had some, I had some gooey butter cake that wasn't even close to the gooey butter cake. It's a shame if they call it that. 
but they have different kind of good breads though. Hard. They have soft breads, I think, too. Carly, I have a steak and white cheddar cheese, and he has arugula. Is that what you said? No, that's not a salad, mine. ain't it? And he has the chicken chipotle panini or something. You look like and I you have turkey. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Turkey chili. <laughs> I was ignoring him. And uh, he has the mac and cheese. Uh, let's give you a better detailed uh, thing of this here. Mac and cheese with some different kind of cheese. It's like white, white cheddar. White cheddar. Um, we, yeah. have, we have some baguettes. Baguettes. Some rocks. Yes. And we have chicken avocado because it has a couple oh, yeah, chunks I on there. The yeah, chicken. Yeah, I forgot about today. Forgot to put some on there. Um, chicken avocado. Um, she has the turkey chili and the steaky steak and white cheddar with chili. Yeah, and turkey. But um, the lighting is kind of kind of weird in here. I don't want to put my high, my other lights and have like a studio in here. Trying to get us kicked out. Yep. I'm gonna try some of this chili if you don't mind. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Pretty rich. I mean, I like the chili though. The, I mean, it all tastes good. I'm more of a quantity type person, not quality. Like selling bunk weed, I heard. Just get a whole bag of bunk. As long as it fills you up, guys. Yeah, D, that was that was $30 you saw. Plus his lemonade. 27 Yeah, yeah. 27 look, Does this look like 20 Look, that. $27. My head's about to explode, people. <laughs> she, that's why she's like... Mm -mm. As soon as I say twenty-seven dollars, I said, "What?" I thought he's meant like seventeen, like twenty-seven. Yeah, I um, I gave him a twenty-dollar bill, and then I was like, "Ooh, gotta give him more." I don't, I said. don't know, Gloria. Well, they were standing off to the side. We didn't go over there, so I have no idea about the people that were in the car. I was about to rush they over there. Get, they were able to get out the car. See my shirt? I was going to rush over there and uh, just fly in and pick up the car and do CPR and uh, whatever it takes. But she was like, no, there's people over there. It's cool. So I went with went with what Tasha said. And you going to throw me in your lap? Well, it, I did. Ask, it's on record that I asked if we should go over there. So if you guys saw the, the live last night, let's see who's lying. James, I think this is my girlfriend. She said alive. so. She said so. Uh, Golden Corral is cheaper. Maybe we should do a Golden Corral buffet type thing sometime. Mike Collison, we met at a challenge. I'm glad that you didn't pick me up at our challenge. She actually, uh, that was a joke, people. But, um, she actually came to a challenge, and let's not get off into the details, but she brought cookies and kind of reeled me in. So she came to Tony's Trophy House. If you watch that video, Tony's Trophy House, um, she's on that one in Collier, Collierville. Uh, let me see. Yeah, Gold Corral atmosphere is louder. Yes, it's not. That's I like the atmosphere here. It's not like McDonald's with people's asking for a dollar because they they lost their passport and they're trying to get to ten towns over. And they told me your whole story of their life because they want a dollar to for mm -hmm. a Big Mac or a dollar chicken sandwich, and then they go to the liquor store across the street instead of getting that chicken sandwich. So usually you don't get that here at Panera's. That's just a scenario, people. Well, Jose made it to two lives in a row. 
Well, one-legged high mechanic, I'm going to take care of this one for you guys. Yes, that person was really adamant about getting heard. Yeah, some people don't have anything else to do, so they got to cause trouble. I'm too old for that. What is happening, one-legged high mechanic? I'm glad you uh, you tuned in to help Katie out here, because Katie is probably uh, taking a break from doing her videos for YouTube, her ASMR videos. Well, I don't know. Um, it's 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 called av. I still got one left. There's one avocado. And this is, this is, uh, you can't say it looks like a crack rock. That's what I heard. I saw, watch TV, people. That's what they look like on TV. But there was two of those hubbers. That's what they call crack. Big hubbers for your, that's a song, isn't it? UCK? I don't know. I just listen to a lot of music and watch TV, okay? That's what I heard it from. Mm. But yeah, there's two chunks on there. So they call, they put it, the name avocado on there. I think you have to have more than one to call it something. But if you want to give me, a, I'll give you a food review of this macaroni and cheese. You have cheese, <clears throat> white cheddar cheese, delectable white cheddar cheese. Oh, I'm on top of my keyboard, glistening. Oh, again. Jesus. Why don't you stop doing it? It's this? so good. I'm dropping my fork, folks. That's how good this is. Mmm, look at that. Look at that delicious macaroni. Can you smell it? Can you smell it? That's what she said. <laughs> okay, well, I did my best, folks. That's what I said. Yeah, you. You all by yourself. It's rich and thick. It's white, rich and thick. <laughs> yes, Mike, those are craft shells, mac and cheese. Stir it like coffee. That's what I heard. Stir it like coffee. Mm -hmm. Greetings. Germany's in the house. You can count the macaroni shells. Yeah, it's really, it's like six dollars. Six freaking dollars. I got robbed. I'm calling the police. The Get a police report. It's expensive because they donate a lot of money. Oh, really? They need to donate it back to me. Because I live on the street. I thought I'd feed people for free. Because they spent all their money here. And they're like, I am sorry, sorry, I'm broke. Because they must have been here before. <laughs> she needs to smack me. <laughs> so you like that better than this? I didn't taste that. You want to try it? It is good, though. No. You don't want to try it. This is a food review. Okay. Well, I was going to try yours, but you don't have much left over there. Huh. You want to try it? Okay, I'm going to try this. Whatever this is. Steak with pickled red onions. That sounds pretty good. <clears throat> you can eat the rest of that. Oh. It's pretty good. It tastes, pretty, it tastes okay. It's steak. A little steak. Nicole, it tastes... It's, it's okay. I mean, <clears throat> it isn't nasty. It's just... It's not, all fresh. I'm going to tell you, it yeah, is all fresh. fresh. They didn't lie to us there. It's just not... Uh, it's not $30 worth to me. That's all. But, I mean, it tastes good. Right up, Panera's people. Let me... Uh, They don't have to see the food either. Well, it, it kind of makes it a little better. She's tall, folks. So, uh, yeah. See how tall she is? Brand is I'm sitting here like this.
you London. gotta try. London's in the house. I'm, we're at Panera's, Jose. Did you tell them that? Yeah, we're at no. Panera's. Hey, London, UK people. Yeah, this is a. This is we ate uh, yesterday at a casino. All you can eat crabs, but it took too too long to eat that. So I just went to eat everything else. He was too impatient to learn how to eat crabs. No, but in his defense, the they crabs. cooked them to where the shells weren't crisp, so you really couldn't like snap them open the way you needed to. Um, but yeah, he was impatient about pulling the crab meat out. So I usually I have freezer pops when I'm hungry. I have freezer pops so instead of eating. Scuba dive. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Help out with this meal. After uh, YouTube gets a hold of the 30%, that's $7. So I'm down to $20 for this meal. <laughs> so scuba, thank you very much. I can live another day to eat somewhere else. Or at least get the gas money. Jason, this Panera wasn't salty. I actually had to add salt to to my chili and to my sandwich. So I don't know if it's different at different ones or whatever, but I had to add salt to it. Do I add some more? Is that what ASMR is smacking? Don't. Is that what ASMR is? They smack. Like they don't normally eat like that. Like normally eat like this. But ASMR is like this. Mm -mm. That's enough ASMR. That's what ASMR is, folks, I think. Chris Barnes is too late. What happened? You saying get back in the car and fly away. Don't pay for whatever that is. Oh, yeah, too late. Taking all mine. Get all my stuff. All of it. I can't see. You okay. Okay, yeah, we're done eating about. ASMR is whispering food noise. This food was really good. Really good. And uh, the mac and cheese and with the white cheddar. You, you Hold on, I'm doing first. a freaking ASMR. <laughs> you got uh, the, chili, the chili was rich and it has some good stuff in there. But the freaking avocados must have had a warrant because they all left except two dummies. He's very special. Very special. That's all indeed. I got right now because uh, $27 just gets you much here to talk about. So thank you for listening, and let's move on to something else. Cause here's some here comes somebody. Let's shh. Okay, all right, guys. That is. I'm gonna get something else. To, something else to drink here. Besides, what kind of juice is that? This is um, blood. Is this called blood orange? Yes, sir. Blood orange lemonade. What's that green stuff? I'm gonna, I'm gonna get him to get it. Uh, the blood orange is the passion supply of Nick's. That's a real good. I like the agave and the blood orange. Yes, that's a really good one. He don't want to be on too no Yeah, he didn't ask. I was about to ask him, but he put his two cents in. Be right back. I'm gonna go get me some orange juice. Give me some stuff. Yeah, Brandon is crazy, but you guys know that already. No, I am not his baby mama. Here's the green tea uh, stuff. Passion for pie again. Okay. What's for dessert? I'm doing good today, Nicola. Um, dessert. 
We we'll probably go somewhere else for dessert. I'm not here. The cookies yeah. are probably ten dollars here. We can go get free samples up there again. Free dessert. <laughs> You this is a passion papaya green tea. You go eat all their free samples. She go get some. Hmm. She go get some, but yeah, dessert's too expensive. If all this is, is expensive, did the bacon contest f me up? No, it didn't. It was just bacon, and actually, I didn't taste too salty at all. She said, "I was like, well." Grease, I call grease is God sweat, okay? Butter and bacon grease is called God sweat. Hold on, Bill. God sweat. Sound butter? No. No. Yeah, dummy, the blood orange tasted better. Yeah, I like the I like the agave. Did you try the agave lemonade? No. You sure? Mm -mm. Was that the first one you had? Yeah. It just tastes like watered down lemonade to me. Well, I like the lemonade up to here, the, the, the agave lemonade, and then I put blood orange from here to here. So it's blood agave lemonade. Oh, sorry. Sorry for that loud. Uh, oh, what you do? Oh, because I did the. The God sweat thing, oh. and it was too loud. I'm, I apologize for that. I was just very, very happy. There is Neil Scott in the house. I'm working on that um, that pasta house as we speak. It's exporting now. So, uh, there's Hi, Luther, Neil. Luther the Great. Neil Scott is in the house. Uh, he showed up to the pasta house uh, and uh, and Festus the the toasted ravioli contest. And actually, Gil. Uh, that was the Boy Scout leader, uh, troop leader, and his son, Gil Jr., came. I saw them again at uh, the doghouse that I'm going to be at on the 19th. So if you're in Crystal City, go to the doghouse, 7 p.m. It's going to be two people against me taking down that big burger. Be there or be square. Yes, agave. Is it agave? He said it. A gave. Agave. A gave. I said agave. I say words wrong on purpose, people, so people can comment and get all irritated about it, like Chipotle and Mimi's and Colonel Sanders, because it doesn't have an R in it. It's Colonel. It doesn't say Colonel. Colonel Sanders. They don't have an R. You ever notice that? Well, how do you say lasagna? Lasagna? Just I say lasagna? Balagna? Bologna. Neil asked was doghouse in the same area. Oh, doghouse, Crystal City. It should be in the same area. It's not five miles away. It's pretty close, though, I would think. It's off of Truman. I think Truman. Hey, Don. But don't go to the doghouse. Don't Google it on Waze. If you Google it on Waze, it tells you the DeSoto De location. They're not in DeSoto no more. They're in Crystal City. I didn't lose it. I, I, I'm, I'm not even looking for it. Yeah, I, I, I lose weight, but I just um, juggle while I'm on the road. Like, I'm about to gain weight while I'm on the road in New York. I can't get, gain too much weight because somebody told me they're not going to be with me if I lose, if I gain some weight. Ooh. I like how you lie on this camera. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm, um, I am not. Uh, I'll probably gain a little bit of weight while I'm on the road. I'm going to New York, and I will show you in about a week or two. I will throw my um, my trip uh, schedule on Facebook and on YouTube community. When are you coming to DMV? I've got my license back. Department of Motor Vehicles. What's DMV? Hey, DMV, like, is that up there, like Detroit, oh. Michigan, Virginia? Oh, is that what that is? I I, I don't know. Oh, I thought DMV was when I lost my license Detroit. for 13 and a half years. Jesse White, oh, Illinois. Like Shout DC, out to Michigan, Jesse White that steals driver's license from people. Oh, DC, Maryland, and Virginia. Oh, okay. I knew it was something. Up I, there. I'm I'm not really sure on on that. Just call agave Mexican sugar. Thank you, Barbara from California. 
Mas Masican or Mexican sugar? Is that what you meant, Mexican? Um, I don't just go to different states because I need to do a challenge because I lose money. This is my full-time job. So what determines me going to different states is the contest. I find a contest first from here to point A to point B, and then I find challenges within that point. If I go this way, not, I'm not pointing at her. I'm, if I go, if I go, <laughs> if I go this, if I go this way over here in the map, and I need to go this way, it's like all out the way. So you get tied up like this and lose money. So I, that's how I find it. So, but when I go, when I'm going to any kind of state in the United States, when I'm on a trip, I will let you guys know. You'll see it posted about a week early. Um, yeah. Um, this one. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and polish hers off here. Thank you. you got anything else? All right, thank you. Oh, can I get some uh what's that uh that other tea? Uh what's it called? I'm starting with a P. Passion papaya? No. P plum. Oh, yeah, is it sweet? Try that out. Uh, no, no ice, thank you. Just a half a glass. And he asked earlier, so I'm taking up on him now. My twenty-seven dollars for Come to the UK. That's even more expensive. When I, I plan on going to the UK, I got my passport. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. Can you anything else? All right, thank you. It's if, just a plum. It's a plum. It's, nasty, it's like it's weird. No, it's just a weird taste. Okay. It might need some sweetener in it. Nasty and weird is two different words. Well, no try. I'm gonna try. You have to use your muscles on that brain. Yeah, but my inside muscles for this one. What has happened, Anomaly? You made it today. Uh, uh, you. Unlike some others, got the notifications like 40, 45 minutes like late. So YouTube, every time it does that, people go to YouTube and give feedback of, "Hey, I'm getting notifications late." I'm glad you made it. What do you think you will have your stop figured out? Um, I've just uh, let you guys know a little earlier, but a week, a week or two, I'll have those. About a week before my trip, I'll definitely have them lined out. So you'll have a week notice. Actually, I could probably tell you a couple already, okay? No. I have to do a little bit. I got some extra, extra security measures I have to do first for those. But... I'm trying to call everybody now and get promotions and everything lined up, but I will I will let you guys know. Hello, Whitney. All right, Ray Ray, you uh, finally got some time to log in. I'm glad you did. You got to join us on this uh, Panera review, but you had to see the review earlier because we just got done doing that. We're just answering questions now. Uh, no, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to go back up to Wade check out Johnny V's breakfast. No, somebody told me about that, so I called them. They laughed at me, said, "Why would we give twelve hundred dollars to somebody?" So they don't, they definitely don't do it. I called them. So somebody tried to get me up there before, and uh, somebody said that they do it. They stay right around the corner. I'm not sure who said told me that. But uh, I called them just to make sure before I drove all the way to Wisconsin, eight hours, and would have got turned around. But anybody that has a, a lead on a challenge or anything, please call them first to see if they even have it um, before getting back with me. Because I, I get like a lot of leads every day. So I have to call them, and 99% of the time, they don't even do them more. But I remember calling that place, and they don't do it. Unless I was mad that day, but they told me no. Jose pressure washers. That's the um, 
the generator I saw that was on your picture on Facebook, I think. Yeah, I wear, Daryl, I wear my shirts a lot, but today I just decided not to wear my shirt. Um, I think she gets tired of me wearing my shirt, so I'm trying to switch it up a little bit. Blame it on her. There you go again. Lying on me. Sweet little me. Oh, right, right, yeah. Uh, Pasadena? Yeah, there's one in Pasadena that doesn't want me to do a bird. Well, he didn't say he didn't want me to do it, but they was bragging on Facebook that nobody's ever beaten this challenge. And I called him and then he kind of, he's kind of sketchy about me coming to do it. So I'm going to have to try to figure out a time. What'd you say? No, I was asking you, what's that be What's be better than all nice? Um, That's not it, is it? No. Wow. Hi, Michael. Lying is bad. Yes, it is. I wish you stopped. You got something on your uh, face. A fly on my face. Yeah. Marco been wearing your shirt. Today. Yes, he has. He's been flexing that shirt on his uh, channel. I appreciate that. I think they do, Tuna. There you go. Thank you very much. You know what? Videos or something? Um, I'm doing the YouTube. Oh, what do you guys do? Just a, I, I do professional eater. Oh, she, hey, there you she's go. a professional sexy girl looker. She just she's go. there for the eye candy. Like you do ASMR stuff? Uh, I'll do ASMR. I got an ASMR channel like a spoof on ASMR, but this uh, I'm a professional eater. What's the, uh, if you don't mind sharing, what is the ASMR? Oh, I'm weird. I'm oh, ASMR? I yeah. thought it was kind of weird, weird, but <laughs> it's uh, it's actually weird. But it's uh, it has to do with visual and audio, like meditational. Mm -hmm. So I like watching golf, like listening to it, like the, the sound. Like, <laughs> Some people like uh, watching the fish tank with the bubbles, hearing the bubbles. That's ASMR, like visual oh, like, no, relaxation. I, um... It's okay. I got my cast off, and now I'm in the boot. I started physical therapy the other day, so maybe around. I think he said in like two weeks I can start driving, but I still can't. Um, I still can't wear regular shoes, and I still can't stand on my leg. But my leg is fine though. Uh, Alan, how do I not gain a ton of weight? Because when I don't do eating challenges and contests in my buffet here and there, I don't, I don't eat much. I eat a lot of freezer pops, a lot of salads, yogurts, and stuff like that. I do a lot of liquids. Yeah, normally I had to buy. Well, a friend of mine, she actually bought me a thing. I called it a leg condom, but it would fit over my cast and on my leg, and um. Uh, that made it easy to shower because I could stand in the shower without my cast getting wet. Them leg condoms work really great because she still has two legs. She did not gain another leg. <laughs> <laughs> and no beach I've never but got I, a boner um, while I ate eating. <laughs> yeah, but now I can I can stand in the shower, but like I said, I still can't put uh, all my weight on my bad leg. Um I'm just ready to be able to function normally. How did you hurt your leg? Month in 70, I ruptured my Achilles. Prickly pear. It's called prickly pear T or something like that. And I had to have surgery. Um, I, I, I have, I'm trying to get my stuff uh, licensed. Um, come to find out. I, in, in the, oops, sorry. I don't want to try no more. Okay. Come to find out. In um, East St. Louis area, I'm the only, you will not believe this, I'm the only person that's trying to license their pickles. Nobody's ever tried to license pickles in East St. Louis, Illinois. Isn't that weird? So I'm like, they're like, hey, let me let me do some research on this from the health department. They try to license their pickles. So there's, well, 
they caught on to us. Okay, but um, that's really weird, and uh, it's not, not just weird. It's people that I don't know the health department. Like nobody's ever tried to license their pickles, so it's disturbing. So I'm trying to get that taken care of first. Um, I did take my tests. I, I took my tests. Actually, it's weird where you take we we give them the samples at. You give them the jars of samples. Guess where you give them the jars of samples at in St. Louis, at the Perina Dog uh, Building. That's where the laboratory is. Your food. <laughs> no lies. Dexter said, "Kicking you numerous times causes a lot of injuries." Heard it here first. She just said it. No. Oh, she's reading. I was reading the comment. She's reading the truth. Yeah, Barbara, they told me, when I went to physical therapy the other day, she told me that I could um, walk in the pool. Um, I knew that because I used to be a water safety instructor. So I worked at a pool before and um, people used to come in there for therapy, but I had planned on doing that. Um, I've been trying to get in there sooner, but the doctor told me that he didn't want me to get in the pool so soon because the the incision on my leg was still healed and he didn't want me in chlorine. So now that it's healed, she the physical therapist told me I can get in the pool, but she doesn't want me to full out swim. She said I can lightly kick, but not like I'm racing or nothing like that. Jose, I didn't know I ruptured it. I actually thought maybe my ankle popped out of place and popped right in. It didn't hurt at all. I heard the pop. I thought um, one of the kids that I was playing with um, kicked me in the back of the leg, but I turned around and there was nobody there, but it didn't hurt at all. I didn't know I was injured like that. Her, her ligaments, are, I think her ligaments are weak from not eating pork. Pork actually uh, strengthens your ligaments. It's a new study. I just did it. <laughs> from all that bacon you just Yes, yeah, all that oh, bacon. Okay. My ligaments are really good. All that bacon affected your brain. Yep, all that God's sweat. God's sweat. <laughs> yeah, every, I, I told him last night, too, when people say, like I say, she don't eat pork. I always say, I always tell them, say, hey, she's a Muslim. She don't eat pork. And I, and I said, I'm just joking because when I first, I first used to do that. I first used to do that with people. Like as soon as they told me they don't eat pork, I thought they was Muslim. I thought that's the only people that don't eat pork. But I know that's not true because I have a lot of friends that don't eat pork right now. Because that's the first thing you should tell them. What are you, are you a Muslim? And I was serious about it. I wasn't being funny. But no, she, she's not Muslim that I know about. What is happening, Paul Cody? Kodo. I'm going to say Kodo. You call me Brando. I'm say Paul Kodo. Paulo. Oh, they say he fell down and flopped around like a fish. Hey, I say that all the time. I somebody hits not, me in the they didn't believe me when I told them. I was like, y'all, I think I hurt my leg or ruptured my... I was like, I think I tore my Achilles or something. And they were like, no. And they were like, you're sitting in the floor too long. I was just sitting just like I'm talking now. I was just sitting there like something wrong with it. It just felt like my foot went to sleep. But yeah. This is my usually drink lemonade and agave. That's just one you're gonna like. I'm like a what am I? I'm a what do you call them? I'm a chemist specialist. What do they call them? The alcohol drink pourers. Like a, I'm a they got a special name for it. So they can charge you more. What? You like lamp? You like lamp more than pork? I know what you mean. You mean lamb? I don't correct people. Okay, I don't correct people. 
because I, I know. Okay, well, I'm going to do a spin wheel thing in here. I'm going to do a spin wheel. I asked you yesterday to uh, put up to put up of uh, some ideas on a spin wheel so I could do uh, like a $20 like super chat. So if I spin this wheel, it has 14. Maybe I should do it at home when I sh they see the wheel to see what I'm talking about. But it's just a spin wheel and it has 14 different like red, yellow, blue, green, um, different spots on it. And I was going to put one of them as a prize to you guys, but I was trying to earn money to, uh, to help pay for a computer that I need because my computer's messing up uh, and it's about to go all the way out. On the, it's going on the fritz right now, but I'm trying to, uh, to uh, just get some money to help pay for that. But I want to put a t-shirt. There you go. I want to put a, a, a free t-shirt on there. So if you spend, you, you have a chance to win a free t-shirt as well. That's it. That's, but that's only in the United States right now. I'm still in, in Canada. I'm trying to get the shirts um, overseas as well. So I'm, I'm still trying to do that. It, uh, it just takes a little time. All right. I think everybody, yeah, all the moderators had left out right now. So if, uh, if Mr. Mike was in here, Batty, I would have to appoint him. Uh, yes, BJ Penn. Um, oh, no problem. I just had to take care of something, um, Ben, but I, I, I handled it. But um, I got... I got a uh, video coming out. I think it's Wednesday of uh, Tasha and I doing a Rizzo's pizza, 11 pound pizza. So we did a challenge together. Then her daughter did one. I think it's coming out the Sunday after that. So next Sunday, uh, uh, it's going to be Milano's pizza of 11 pound pizza. <clears throat> uh Jose, the moderator is uh, like the one, the wrench right there. That's it, like Ben, one legged Honda mechanic, uh, Aaron, um, Miss Hobbs, uh, Katie Pretty Man, uh, Beyonce at Elites. Uh, that's in the room that helps out uh, with uh, some people that like to cause trouble in the room. They, they handle that while I'm talking, so I don't have to, I don't have to worry about it. But already, uh, and Katie Clawson, sorry about that. Yeah, Katie, I, had to, I just had to take care of something real quick because it was uh, somebody just wanting to start trouble because they have nothing else to do. But I, I, took, I took care of it. I appreciate you guys being in here, though. How about giving away a few of your challenge T-shirts? Kim, you must not have just heard on that wheel that I was talking about. That's, I'm going to put one one of those spots is going to be a free T-shirt. That's if, But that's only if you stay in the USA or the Canada because I cannot ship overseas right now. But I'm, I'm working on the overseas thing. But right now, it will be one one spot on the wheel would be that. So right now, let's just, uh, let's just do uh, the ideas on the spin wheel. That's what I was trying to get at right now. So if you guys got anything, like say – I don't know if it's like a $20 super chat, but it has to be like a $20 super chat. And then I spin the wheel for the $20. And if it lands on a free t-shirt, then you get a free t-shirt. Uh, but the other 13, I need like different ideas. Checkmate. I think I'm not going to, I'm trying to gain subscribers and not lose subscribers. So that's like a select crowd that might want to see that. I'm going to say 10 people out of, 30,000 people might want to see that. And I might drop 29,000. No, I've never had to go to the hospital after a challenge. Oh, well, no. Before a challenge, I did because she ruptured her Achilles uh, tendon because she didn't eat enough pork. 
<laughs> Jasper Tefnut's in the house. Um, and this is right here, Jap Jasper Chestnut. Is chestnut. Not Chestnut. Oh, I'm thinking of uh, Joey Chestnut. Uh, sorry, Tefnut. Uh, but Jasper is is in the Sunday video, okay? The eleven pound pizza. That's that's her daughter, okay? Jasper, not chestnut, Tefnut. Uh, thank you very much, Checkmate. I appreciate it. I got past 30,000 30, because I didn't do those videos like that. <laughs> Pick a nasty food for you to eat. Okay, uh, but. On the wheel. Yeah, but but it, but it should be, be like a nasty burrito or three items. Like I'll just pick some stuff that's in my refrigerator, like three items from my refrigerator and two condiments mixed together, something like that. I can I can write that down. But, so one item would be pick three items from my refrigerator, three fruit food items, and then. Two two condiments mixed together. BJ P and X, we're gonna do a catch and cook. Okay. I guess if we ever go and catch enough fish to be able to cook, then yes. We have another fishing <laughs> vlog coming out. The fishing vlog part three. Let's see who won. You gotta watch it to see. But uh it's coming out maybe another week, the fishing vlog, maybe two weeks. I don't know. I, I have to get some food eating videos out because that's what people want to see. Thank you, Katie. Because he's out of his mind. Katie, yeah, Katie said nothing with mold and no raw potatoes, I guess. Thank you, Don. Uh, a lot of people like that intro uh, sliding in. A bucket of red vines. A bucket. That's like a lot for that. How much is a bucket? What are red vines like? Twizzlers? Yeah. Red vines. We have them in art. You don't have them in this area? St. Louis has them. Swizzlers. They have red vines? Um, I don't know. I know we have Twizzlers. Is red vines like a knockoff version or something? Um, no, it's just a different, just a different brand. Oh. Um no onions. It's okay. Onions are okay. It's just not having full raw onions. One raw onion is good. It's just sitting in your mouth. We're not eating onions. No, if it sits in your mouth, that's the problem where it's just sitting there. Once you eat it and just goes down, it's the sulfur that sits. That when you when I was chewing it, okay, and it was burning, it was stuck right here. So that's what I was doing. But I mean, I would do a whole raw onion for twenty dollars. But it could be like a slice of onion with something on top of it. You know. But it won't be like a whole massive amount of food for twenty dollars spend. It'll just be you know, just like my nasty mukbangs I do with like three items mixed together. That's only one one chart. We need to get going on this. How much? Uh, we're not picking three foods that I'm eating right now. I'm just that's just one thing on the wheel. That's just one thing on the wheel that we're just picking from. So when I open my refrigerator, three items from the refrigerator. You know, not. Three items, three items from the refrigerator and two condiments. So that's that's done deal. We're not picking marshmallows or nothing right now because that's not even in my. Who keeps marshmallows in the refrigerator? <laughs> okay. We're just doing ideas right now of each item. I think we're all lost right now. I might just pick them myself if this is difficult. This is really too difficult. Kevin, I'm fine with him doing. Competitive eating. It's not hurting me or him. Okay, garlic cloves. Heard there's good. They're good for you. I just don't like when you do crazy stuff. How about swallowing hot dogs? What if one of them's swallowing four hot dogs? No, not at one time. No, just one at a time. Okay. This, I'm not doing full hot dogs at once. What's do you think I'm crazy? I'm putting. I'm just gonna start. This is this is difficult. Yeah, a thousand clothes for five dollars. I think I'm not gonna do that one. Something you don't like. Eat a pound to pick a pound. 
that is going too too crazy. But oh, for twenty dollars, how big are pig's feet in the jar? Like, oh, it's too big. But that's, that's what with the said. bones, though. You don't eat that hard. Yeah, but slobbering all over that pickled pig's feet for that long for twenty dollars. That's like a fifty dollar thing. I don't know. I'll probably throw up on camera trying to do that. Mm -mm. Would you guys let's see nobody would even tune in if I buy a jar of pickled pig's feet and me sit there trying to eat that whole jar of pickled pig's feet. People would like to see the disgust, but I don't think it'll make a good video. I might try pickle pick. I don't know. Chicken feet. How do you? Does pickle? chicken feet have meat on it? It just looks like. I just slobber all over it. I might put a pickle pig's feet on the the, the the wheel. You think I should put a pickle pig's feet on the wheel? Not five or ten of them. One pickle pig's feet. I don't like them. Kimberly, I leave all that bad and crazy acting up to him. She was asking why I'm not in any of this. She's skits. not even a good bad actor. She can't even act. <laughs> okay, yeah, people, you're not getting the point of this twenty dollar wheel. For twenty dollars, I'm not going to eat a whole gallon of ice cream. I'll I'll, I'll pick. I probably have to pick this myself because you guys are going overboard with it it's just a 20 dollar will uh and i just told you before i'm not doing massive amounts of food when you spend and trying to do a gallon for 20 dollars and then turn around and do five pounds of pickle pig's feet and then spin it again i'm not going to get far on that video uh i just thought it'd be easy to pick something just strange not nothing like 10 pounds of ice cream for 20 dollars well, ice cream is like eight and a half pounds. That's eight and a half pounds for twenty dollars, and then I won't have nothing else to do. Andrew, does like with that? Is, do you eat the whole foot, or is it like you eating the skin off of it? Like when you cook it, is it? Um, I don't know. I've never seen anybody eat chicken feet. I did see. Bam, bean boozles is a good idea, but I'm going to put all of them, all the bean boozles in the little pack, not like a big pack. I'll do a whole handful of bean boozles at one time. That's nasty. I'm just getting an eyes exam, examined today. Oh, because you think good. I look you ugly. Won't you need your eyes fixed. Since y'all in denial about glasses. Whole handful of hey, bean boozled. Big boozled, one handful, okay? One handful, like a half a cup. Half a cup. Or three quarters, whatever. I'll do that one. Because when I first did that, I thought my sister gave me those. And I thought you were supposed to do them all at one time. I did them all no, at one time. Yes, I did. It's supposed to be like the same that color was, when it's one supposed to be like good and one supposed to be bad. That was nasty. Like BJ's talking about. I'll, I'll, I'll probably pass on that. For twenty dollars, Marco, Marco, what is happening? I uh, I appreciate you uh, uploading the videos, man. You're doing a good job, and thanks for wearing my t-shirt. Would I shave my beard for twenty? I would shave my beard, but I don't know twenty dollars. If somebody throws a hundred at me, I might, I might do it. I'm not sure. I should have done it with the beard was longer and to get, see if I could do 500, but it's too late for that. I, I did it for free. Have you ever had orange juice in your cereal? Jazz, I think he did that before. Yeah, I did all kind of stuff. Yeah, because you ate onions in your cereal and something else you was putting Onions and, yeah, I did a lot of stupid stuff in there. So... That would be, well, let me see, well, I'm still on the spin wheel, people. I'm trying to do the spin wheel. So orange juice in your, usually I don't even have orange juice at home. So, but I can do cereal with some liquid, some sort of liquid that I, I, I'll pick something other than water or milk. How about that? Would that be something good that I get to pick? 
Yeah. I want to do a whole thing of Worcestershire sauce with cereal. That's not too healthy and it's pretty bad. How about a drinkable liquid, like a regular drinkable, like Gatorade or something like that? I can do cereal plus a drinkable liquid. It could be pickle juice. How about cereal with pickle juice? Is that a good freaking? I got pickle juice at home. Cereal with I say one death nut per 20. Pickle. You can't do the death. You have to do the death nut the whole time through. I mean, you have to. It's a it's the death nut challenge is five different levels and you have to do them all at one time like the different levels at the same sequence so I can't break that up cereal with pickle juice eat a deer hoof <laughs> uh -huh. yeah I said hoof. Did you go to? No, I didn't go to apple pie in contest. Um, where's Murphy Burrow? Murphy's Burrow is up there, like Nashville. Oh, that's too far, and I think it's it was probably free. No, I didn't go to that one. I think chicken feet's gonna be out the question. Uh, I don't even. Uh, I don't even know about chicken feet. Yeah, Jazz, I ignored that. Andrew, um, use well if you usually drink toilet toilet water. I mean, I usually in our household we wasn't brought up on that. So anything that you normally drink, uh, like Gatorade, toilet water was not in our on our shopping list. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll, I'll be doing some home cooking videos in the future. I just don't have time. I'm not even home like three weeks out the month. Plus, I have the vlogs to do. I have the challenges, the contest, flying here and there, uh, editing videos. So it's rough trying to do cooking videos right now. In the future, I'll, I'll be doing more of that and less of the, the challenges and contests. Milk and vinegar. That would be so disgusting. Milk and vinegar? Yeah. Didn't, isn't that supposed to do some kind of chemical reaction? Yeah, it's going like to lump up. Like anything I think I did that. Oh, I did that before in a video. I did. Somebody told me to do that. Oh. Yeah, and then I heated it up in a microwave, which is really nasty. Jalapeno poppers. I think, didn't I, I did a video of jalapeno poppers already, and I think I used sweet peppers. Kim, buttermilk is not, I know people that drink buttermilk. Yeah, if you don't have buttermilk when you're using it, use a little bit of lemon juice in your milk. That's what, they, that's what I use with my banana bread if I don't have buttermilk. I don't have Balut in our in our shopping um, area or Duran, and I wouldn't do that for twenty dollars probably. That would have to be up there. I'm gonna have to have two wheels. I need a big high roller wheel. That's what I need. A hundred dollar high roller wheel. That will be coming soon after the twenty dollar one. How about that? Then I can get some crazy stuff on there, like a gallon of ice cream for a hundred dollars. Start a challenge, bro. Yori, I did actually start a challenge. Nobody did yet. Was when did I do that? Um, that onion, that raw onion on that video. Which video was that? I did a raw onion after a video. One, one, one of you in here probably would know. Well, I should know because I did it. But I did it at the end of a video. The raw onion. That was before the red robin. Before the red, it was before the red robin video. But it came out after the Red Robin video, and they think that I did that. Oh. I'm not sure which one video it was. Hot dog water, I did that on the video already as well. But I got to have hot dogs to have hot dog water to cook them. I don't even cook my hot dogs. I just, I just use those to swallow them whole. 
one free spin. Make one a free spin. But if they hit that free spin, they just get another spin. You know? I don't, I don't want to waste the spots. How about one of them be go either way to two spots? Like they could pick that one or that one. No? That sounds good. Like uh, jump two spots either way. Which one Which one do you pick? Uh, I did three onions. No, I actually did four onions the same day. I did the speed onion right beforehand. I did that one. And then I did the three onions and the live. So I did that the same day, like an hour or two apart. But if you guys can figure out which video that was, I can't even think of it. I should just put that video out by itself. Uh, I can't think of it. And which video did you say? It's an onion video, but it's after after one of my challenges. White vinegar and milk. Uh, but what would I do? I I gotta have milk at the house usually. And I don't normally have milk. I just need to get milk. How, how about that? No, it's not that one. It's after. It's after a video. What's my new? What's the video right around? Does it show it in order? The one I did, like the videos? Yeah, almond milk I definitely won't have. My daughter might have it, but almond milk's like four times more expensive. Our milk's only like a dollar fifty or two dollars. Okay, Jose, I'm gonna throw that down. She'll be happy with this one. One stick of butter. <laughs> One stick of butter. Dragon pizza is hot. Did I do it on the dragon pizza video? Was it dragon pizza? Is it close to here? Dragon pizza was recently, wasn't it? Are these in order? Yeah. Oh. I'm still trying to find out, guys, where I did that onion one at. Huh. I don't know. Try the dragon pizza one. There was dragon pizza right Yeah, there. try that one. But that's what Katie was she said try that one. Can you go? Go all the way to the end. This should be all the way to the end. Nope. Nope, Katie, it's not that one. Wow. White Barn. I think it might be the White Barn. Thank you, uh, Butthole Source. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, B33 really liked your name. I, I... How far back is White Barn? I don't know. I don't know. You can just type in White Barn in my name. There it is. She was on that one. Yeah, that's why I, I try. I try to get you involved in some of this picking stuff. It's twenty dollars, folks. It's, I'm not gonna jump off a bridge on fire. Mm -hmm. And um, but the white barn video. Thank you, Katie. I appreciate it very much. Uh, the white barn video is the one that I did the raw onion. I did yeah. the speed. So that's that's a challenge within itself. If anybody wants to try that. I'm going to do the stick of butter as far as I'm going to go. I'm not going to do vegetable shortening or hot fat lard. No. I'm not going to be doing bacon grease, Slurpees, nothing like that. So I might pick the rest of them. I'm just trying to get you guys involved in picking this wheel, but getting crazy with it. I'm, I can't. Um, I'm just trying to have fun with this as well. So I already got picked three items from a refrigerator with two condiments. Um, I have garlic cloves. I have four hot dogs swallowed, not at one time, but uh, pickled pig's feet, which I'm not really going to even like. I don't even want to put that on there. 
I got bean boozled. I got cereal with pickle juice. I got one stick of butter. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and a t-shirt. So you get a free t-shirt if you can get on that one. Free t-shirt if you're in the U.S. or Canada. Super hot chili. Uh, I guess I could do a Carolina Reaper, folks. I do have those from um, Luther the Great, Neil Scott. So I put in the Carolina Reaper, one Carolina Reaper, okay? Carolina Reaper. One liter lemon juice. I'm going to pass. <laughs> Big Bird, see? Jose saw Big Bird. Mm -hmm. That's what little kids little kids think when they see her. Look at that tall Big Bird. Uh, well, Pickle Pig's Feet, uh, digital watcher, people know that that's like one food. I said I will never do a, a food contest. So if you see a food contest with Pickle Pig's Feet, I won't be there. No, that's fine. But yeah, that's why I put it on the wheel because that's like kryptonite to me. I really do not like pickled pig's feet. Will you jump off a bridge on fire while eating an onion for 40? No. Last night for 40, I did that. But that's a lot easier than doing what you just said. I'm going to pass on that. Tomato. I don't have tomatoes in my refrigerator and I'm not growing them this year. So I won't have tomatoes in my refrigerator. Uh, I can just think of different concoctions that I have around the house that I can put on the list. But I got, I, got, I pretty much have one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I got nine, so I only need like five more. And one of them, I'm one of them. I'm just going to put. Uh, you get to pick either way, two spaces, or whatever's on the, on the side of it. Up or down, you can pick the nearest the nearest one to that space. Jump, jump one stays back or forward, I guess. Smoke turkey next. That's not even a challenge. That's delicious. <laughs> Okay, usually if I have peanut butter, I'm going to try that one. But for this list, though, i got to make sure I have all this stuff down. So I will guess I will do the, the vinegar and milk, okay, folks? How, how much vinegar and milk? Like one cup a piece? That's a lot of vinegar to milk. So one cup of milk, one cup of vinegar. Dexter, it's some jelly beans and what they do is like like say you got two brown jelly beans one of them be like chocolate pudding and the other one would be Doo -doo. dog food so it's impossible to tell which one that's what bean boozle is but i'm just going to do a whole cup and throw them in my mouth at one time so it's going to be a lot of nasty stuff too one of them's a sock one of them's coconut so it'll be coconut or a sock like a stinky sock and it actually tastes pretty nasty and they, I never tasted a smelly a smelly sock but but when you eat it your brain's like that is a smelly sock even though I'm with Katie let's change it to half a cup of each half a cup of what or whatever you just one cup of milk half a cup vinegar no half a cup of both well that'd be better to have a whole cup of milk right oh okay yeah it's only a cup okay I'm just gonna do one cup of each folks Half cup vinegar, half cup vinegar. Okay, half cup vinegar. One cup milk. Two cups milk, half cup vinegar, because it, it needs to gelatinize. Somebody said pickles and peanut butter. Maybe. 
you keep saying raw octopus i don't usually stock raw octopus <laughs> something hot i did a carolina rooster yeah <laughs> um I, I got a carolina reaper down here so i'm, I'm pretty sure that's that's hot eat I'll, some bugs from your yard all right kim thank mm -hmm. you now i'm not gonna do bugs people those aren't even in a controlled environment. Like I did the bugs to drive. They have a controlled environment. They're not eating out of trash and stuff like that. So we got crackheads and like heroin needles all around. They're probably like heroin bugs. And you might get addicted to eating bugs because of the heroin. I don't know. What's the flower about? Eating flour? Pregnant women eat pickles and peanut butter. Give a shout out and challenge video on Will. For twenty dollars, I'm not sure. I mean, I, I'll do it, but what do you think about that? You can win a shout out on a challenge video. I don't know. What do you guys think about that? Uh, Natasha, um, Natasha O. Chip Shank uh, said, give a shout out challenge on the challenge video. So if you spin it and hit that wheel, then on a challenge video that's coming out, I have to give you a shout out. Or would you rather just me see me do stupid stuff? Okay, um, we'll, we'll table that one, Natasha. Chaz, for twenty dollars, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna eat a whole loaf of bread, sixteen ounce bar of cheddar cheese, and sixteen ounce of bologna. That sounds just like a challenge video or something, and like a speed challenge. Bowl of shredded wheat, no drinks. Sandpaper. Ooh. I'm trying to find stuff that I usually have around the house. Okay. I'll probably pick the rest of them. Um, I'll just figure some stuff out around the house I usually have. Maybe go live again before I do it to sh while I'm at home and I, I have a better understanding of it. So I got stuff down now. But other than that, do you have any other questions for us before we jump off of here? We're going to get off here in a second. Did you have to meet uh, her somewhere? Or... No? Okay. Uh, thank you, uh, Dominic. All right, you too, Mike. I appreciate all your help, and you have a great weekend. Everybody, hopefully, have a great weekend. But I will um not no worries. I'll uh teaspoon oh a tablespoon of cinnamon. That will suck. That's a good idea though. It won't kill me. It'll just make me stronger. Huh? Huh? Don't do that. Don't do that. Ooh. We'll see. Okay. But I already got these down here. I'll check these out when I get home, okay? And um other than that, I appreciate everybody for tuning in and we're gonna jump off of here and uh skedaddle so thank you very much for tuning in and um bring some money to panera if you're coming please because this is expensive all right toodles guys